an alleged ex-employee of Three Rivers District Waste Depot has come forward with a catalogue of shocking allegations about the way in which staff on the ground are treated by management. The employee attests to a systemic culture of corruption, bullying, harassment, ridicule, hypocrisy, nepotism, physical violence and theft of council property. Perhaps the most horrifying of all is the allegation of racial attacks including screwdrivers being stabbed into the leg of a black employee and then covered up by management. Employees are said to have been mercilessly ridiculed by management for not being sufficiently manly, while female applicants have been discriminated against and not offered jobs. The whistleblower claims that corruption is rife, including former drivers using council refuse lorries for private work and paying a manager to turn a blind eye, managers filling up private cars with fuel from a tank in the yard during the fuel crisis and valuable items being taken away from house clearances and sold with subsequent funds pocketed by management. Outbreaks of physical violence are said to be swept under the carpet by say, the same management who are incapable of dealing with the conflict without themselves resorting to violence. It is also alleged that employees are frequently the subject of humiliation, bullying, harassment and ridicule by management which has led to such deterioration in mental health that at least two members of staff have attempted suicide. A My Local News photographer experienced the unsettling environment firsthand when on site she was subjected to a torrent of verbal abuse and industrious language and was deliberately misdirected and followed by a staff member. A TRDC spokesperson said the council is aware of these allegations by a former employee and is investigating the matter. All complaints and allegations are taken seriously. This has been Bryn Holmes for My Local News.